5G was one of the most exciting prospects as we entered 2020, but the world has now changed forever. COVID-19 has delivered a terrible blow to human life and brought about an economic downturn. An indisputable business fact is that the need for organizations to be digital has never been greater. And I believe 5G, along with edge computing, will play a key role in our global economic recovery. Across all industries, our clients are telling us about the imperative to accelerate their digital transformation. Prior to COVID-19, digital had momentum. Everybody could see the imperative. Now the need is greater, perhaps even one of survival. Connectivity plays a key role in any digital transformation. And this has been seen in both fixed and wireless for more than two decades. While the 5G business case was strong before, it's even stronger now. I'm Alex Holt. I'm the Global Head of Telecoms and Media at KPMG. I'm on lockdown here at home in Silicon Valley. And over the next 10 minutes, I'm going to share with you why I believe that by investing in 5G and edge computing, the telcos can position themselves to come out of this crisis stronger than ever. I'd like to quickly take you back to Mobile World Congress 2019, where I presented research and data on the business case for 5G. We'd be doing a lot of work for the telcos around the world as they tried to figure out their 5G strategies. The messages we presented in 2019 were clear and simple. The business case for 5G was far stronger in B2B than in B2C, where we shone a light on $4.3 trillion of upside. We said that consumers won't pay enough incrementally for 5G to cover the cost of the new networks, like we saw in 3G and 4G. And therefore, telcos should focus their attention on B2B more so than ever before. We said that the global trajectory for rollouts will be gradual through the 20s, with private networks going first, followed by cities, and then some nationwide coverage. KPNG analysis by sector showed that those industries that are most geographically centralized will benefit from 5G first. And as you can see here, manufacturing is a good example. We had a great reaction to the analysis, but our clients encourage us to go further and reveal exactly how you tap into such a big number. Which brings us nicely to 5G and edge computing, which we believe when correctly integrated could be one of the most powerful synergies of technologies ever to coexist. The intersection between 5G and Edge is the key value creator and critical to the business case for 5G. 5G provides the capability to support billions of connected devices transmitting huge volumes of data. Autonomous vehicles, manufacturing, transport, healthcare, and many other sectors and activities that depend on instant data transfer. Edge computing is about bringing the processing or storage of data for an application much closer to the end user, instead of needing to send processing loads deep into the network to access the cloud. These loads can be dealt with at the edge of the network, creating significant network and technology optimization. To bring this all to life, we looked at who is in the emerging 5G edge computing ecosystem. We examined the main players to determine how telcos can best position themselves and what they need to do to gain a share of the increasingly large prize. As you can see here, we found that there are four main players in the ecosystem. These players will work together and also compete for their piece of the prize. The next thing you'd probably asking is about the size of the opportunity. How is this total opportunity defined and likely to be shared across the different players? And if you're compelled by the numbers we're about to show you, the next step is for you to create a value plan to maximize your position in the ecosystem. And while every sector is likely to benefit from 5G and edge computing, we wanted to highlight the sectors where the new service delivered as a result of their combination was most illuminating. Analysis from KPMG and IDC estimated the addressable market across the ecosystem for just these five industries to be worth more than $500 billion by 2023. In selecting these five industries, our intention wasn't just to go after the biggest dollar signs, but to capture the imagination of those in the ecosystem and the vertical to see the art of the possible. 
We've released a paper with the full details for you to download, but let me bring a couple of these examples to life. Let's start with manufacturing. Through predictive maintenance, 24 seven asset monitoring, minimized downturn and improved safety performance, manufacturing can be truly transformed. Higher quality products produce faster and at lower cost with less waste, lower maintenance, material and energy costs reduced and a more sustainable low emission environment. But what about the COVID-19 effect? Many factories have been forced to close during the pandemic, but the benefits of 5G and edge computing to the manufacturing environment are so compelling that it could hold the key to accelerate recovery for manufacturers. By accelerating digitization, manufacturers can reduce costs and improve the speed and quality of products. We're not suggesting the cost of a 5G upgrade will be an option for everyone, but the harsh reality is that those able to make the upgrade are likely to leave the rest of their peers behind as the markets come out of the economic downturn. The numbers are clear for manufacturing, an incremental 51% addressable markets worth 206 billion by 2023. It seems right that our second example, we highlight healthcare, which is arguably one of the biggest beneficiaries of better data and AI. Whether in the hospital or out in the community, patients can be monitored constantly via sensors that collect and analyze health information and alert physicians and caregivers. The hospital of the future can also track location and performance of its high value medical equipment. The outcome of such advances is improved care, better quality of life at lower cost. Hospitals and clinics, meanwhile, get better value from those expensive assets with less downtime. And the COVID-19 impact, or well, the healthcare sector has done an astonishing job during this pandemic. And a huge thank you to all the caregivers around the world. There's no doubt a more digitized healthcare sector through virtualized and remote care would help patients and providers. We believe that 5G and edge computing will help track infections across the population and provide real-time insights that minimize spread and protect health workers. 5G and edge will create an incremental 66% addressable market, growing to 45 billion by 2023. But most importantly, it'll be helping to save lives. I thought it would also be helpful to see how the dollars are split between the various players in the ecosystem. You should note that connectivity alone is only 11% of the total market. So if you're a telco, it's important to think about your current trajectory and if you're best placed to capture that 5G plus edge computing opportunity. So we've outlined four steps that we think will help. Firstly, protect the core. While much of the value is beyond the connectivity layer, nailing down your core business today is vital. Diversifying capabilities. The future is going to look very different from the past. AT&T, for example, are retraining nearly half of their workforce. What are your plans? Embed connectivity. Can you use M&A to strengthen your position? And verticalize. We believe those who create specific vertical propositions in this space will truly prosper. At KPMG, we call the companies that lead in digital outpaces. And I believe that tomorrow's outpaces will use 5G and edge computing to deliver the next industrial revolution. COVID-19 is creating a global crisis, but it's not how your organization went into COVID-19 that will define your future. It's how you come out of it. So we humbly suggest the following, be in the future. Our forecasts to capture the $517 billion outlined here are only to 2023. There is a huge amount happening on the horizon. And if you're going to be an outpacer, you need to know the direction things are moving. Make new friends. We cannot stress enough how important close partnerships are to succeeding in this market. Cultivate strong relationships, nurture them and help your partners. Invest big. Deploying 5G and Edge is not cheap but the rewards are significant. With the massive push to digital, the cost of being left behind is arguably greater. Create your future. We have only covered five use cases today. The truth is that there are hundreds more. Stay ahead of the game by finding an edge in uncharted territory. 
experiment and take risks. And finally, start doing. Strong leadership is needed to move things forward and we all need to stop talking about it and start doing it. Today is as good as any day to get going. Over the last two decades, we've seen economies and societies prosper as their communications infrastructure progresses. Telcos have the opportunity to seize the 5G and edge opportunity, and in doing so, I believe create a key pillar in our global economic recovery.